Good morning from the 90 Ranch. Here we've got uh, the butterfly garden. Some of the blooms that uh, are special today. Early in the morning, on the first day of the week, the women took spices they had prepared and went to the tomb. When they arrived, they found the stone had been rolled away. They went inside and they did not find the body of the Lord Jesus. While they were wondering about these things, suddenly two men with clothes that shone like lightning stood before them. And in their fright, they bent down to the ground. <coughs> But they said, the men said, Why do you look for the living among the dead? He is not here. He is risen. Remember how he told you while he was still in Jerusalem that he must be turned over to sinful men, crucified, and then be raised again. Then the women remembered those things. And they went back and they told all the others, the eleven, all the things that they had seen. It was... Um, Mary Magdalene, Joanna, Mary, mother of James, and the other women who told the apostles. But they did not believe them because they thought their words were foolishness. However, Peter got up and ran to the tomb, and he found it just as they had said. And when he bent down, he found strips of linen laying there by themselves on the ground. And he went away wondering about these things. Now on that same day, two of them were walking to a village of Emmaus, about seven miles from Jerusalem. And as they walked along, they were talking about all these things that had happened. And as they were walking along discussing these things, suddenly Jesus himself came and walked with them. But their eyes were kept from recognizing him. And as they walked along, Jesus said to them, What are you discussing as you walk along together? And they said, they stopped. And they said, Are you only a visitor here? Do you not know all these things that have happened in these days? And Jesus said, what things? And they said, about Jesus of Nazareth, prophet mighty before God and man in word and deed. And our chief of priests and the rulers turned him over to be crucified. And we had thought he was the one that was going to redeem Israel. Jesus said, Oh, you slow of heart and foolish to not believe all that the prophets have spoken. Did he not have to be crucified and raised from the dead? And then Jesus began with um, Moses and all the prophets, and he explained to them all that was spoken about himself in the scripture. And as they approached the village of Emmaus and came close, it appeared that Jesus was going to go on. And so they urged him strongly, come with us, go inside, because it is yet almost dark, almost night. And so Jesus went in with them. And when they sat at the table, he gave thanks. He took the bread and he broke it and he gave it to them. And then... Their eyes were opened and they recognized him. And he disappeared from their sight. They immediately got up and went back and told all the others, He is alive and we have seen him. Happy Easter to everyone.